inside San Quentin State Prison, there are people who are making a difference to increase public safety. These uncommon heroes are citizens from California communities throughout the Bay Area and beyond, free and incarcerated, both committed to change. They form groups and programs to help inmates transform their lives before returning to society while emphasizing social justice. Have brainstorming meeting of different people from the community to figure out what's going on. In GRIP, inmates learn how to stop violence. It starts off helping us to look back into our childhood. Through the help of outside volunteers, veterans work together to heal each other. The prison's media center teaches men how to use radio, video, and print to tell stories about incarceration and its greater impact on society. Unsung heroes come into San Quentin to do a little bit of everything, like teaching creative writing to the men. In recent years, inmates have learned about emerging technology and entrepreneurship. Our first challenge was, how do we test the mobile features without ever having access to a mobile device? In 2015, U.S. District Court Judge Delton Henderson visited the prison to the delight of many inmates. In September 2016, the Prison University Project was awarded the National Humanities Medal at the White House for teaching inmates college courses. Education is not enough if employers are not willing to hire formerly incarcerated citizens, so volunteers and inmates also conduct employment readiness seminars. Kids, prosecuted as adults, learn to create awareness together with the help of outside volunteers and the support of the prison administration. All the world is a stage. At San Quentin, with the sponsorship of Marin Shakespeare, inmates learn to be thespians and perform before live audiences. Many of the stories that take place behind the walls are captured by the award-winning publication San Quentin News. Alongside the newspaper, the San Quentin Prison Report is an award-winning program that highlights the transformative works of the incarcerated population and is an affiliate of SQTV, the prison's TV station that produces video content of events, PSAs, and other institutional needs. Students from the University of California, Berkeley, and their professor come in to help San Quentin News and the San Quentin Prison Report with their media endeavors. Even the publisher of the Oakland Post gets in on the act. Centerforce has taught hundreds of inmates over the years how to maintain good health and how to avoid communicable diseases. Inside San Quentin is its annual health fair, the largest of its kind to take place inside of a prison in the nation. Volunteer medical staff come from all over the Bay Area to teach men about health issues. There's nothing else like it. Much more takes place behind the scenes, like volunteers that come in to help tutor men in the GED program. They are not well known, but appreciated by the men who need their assistance. Inmates who arrive at San Quentin are amazed by its annual Day of Peace celebration with many staff, volunteers, and other outside guests participate. Like many other California state prisons, San Quentin also hosts the annual Get on the Bus program. All of this takes place on any given day in California's oldest prison.